going on, everybody? I am the Game Salmon, and welcome to the long-awaited Five Nights at Candy's 2. Now, I thought the original game was very well put together. I think it was one of the better Five Nights at Freddy's copies out there back, you know, months ago. And that kind of sets the bar for this game kind of high, but I'm sure that this game will exceed all expectations and scare me right out of the pants that I am not currently wearing. All I ask of this game is just to not make me poop in my underwear. Hi! Hey! Hello! Are you there? Am I? I don't know. LOL, you lost the bet. Do I get to know what the bet was? Or will that come later? You know what that means? That I get to die to an animatronic cat? You have to spend five nights in that old factory again. Oh, again, so I've done this before, so it should be no problem. Or else people will think you're a chicken. Scared? What? I don't want people thinking I'm a chicken. Ooh, I get to type a reply. Uh, does it matter what I type? I ain't be no chicken. I can English great. The Mao. Yeah, you better laugh at my terrible English. Okay, first night, let's do this. You're surrounded by darkness. Press space to use the camera flash from your cell phone. Use this to briefly be able to see down the dark hallway. Flick the mouse downwards to turn to the camera panel. Okay. Uh, can I do anything with the stuff on my desk? Does your nose honk? <gasps> it does. Well, it doesn't honk. It more squeaks. Can I do anything with this over on the left side? No. Okay, let's check out the camera panel. Flick the mouse up to go back. Click on the camera icons to view the cameras. You can call any of the internal phones in the building through the camera panel. Any phone you will call will make a ringing noise which will echo throughout this central hall. The animatronics can only hear the phones if they are in the same room as the phone or if they are in the central hallway. Use the phones to lure the animatronics out of the central hall before they get to you. Uh, be careful. If they reach the room with the ringing phone, they will try to temporarily disable the phone. Press X to hide hints. Well, I want to keep the hints for now. Let's see if we can get a visual on these animatronics. Okay, that's kind of close to me. I shouldn't have clicked that one. Let's click. No, stop it. No, okay. I still don't have a visual on these animatronics. I need to find them. I don't see them. Okay. Let's just ring that one, I guess. <gasps> what? Ah! Hi! Okay! You know what? Let's have some fun. Let's go ahead and press X to hide hints. Okay. All right. Well, I saw you. Okay. Well, you're th I'm in trouble. I am I'm in trouble. I don't know what's going on. I am I am going to die. Let's let's see here. Uh are you in the central hall? I don't know. Ah! Hello. Let's click that one. Let's see if she'll go over there. Hi. Okay. This is already fun. This is already great, and I get the gist of what I have to do. Okay, how many of them am I going to be dealing with? Because I'm only dealing with you right now. And let's try to keep you in camp. Fourteen! Oh, you disabled the phone. <gasps> no. Let's turn on that one. Maybe you'll go there. Actually, no, let's turn on this one. I'm trying to figure out your movements. I think I got you. Where'd you go? Oh, you're over there? I don't know why you decided to go over there. Okay. Ah! Oh, no. Hi! Okay. Uh, let's get you in cam 11, I guess. Yes, okay. I got the gist of the game. It's 2 a.m., and I am assuming that we are going to 6 a.m., or at least... Let's just hope we're going to 6 a.m. I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed with the phone mechanic. It's basically a nice throwback to Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Uh-oh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? You should be going to Camp 15, right? There you go. Good, okay. I don't see anyone else. We are at 5 a.m. I'm gonna cross my fingers that we're going to 6 a.m. Because I like it when these games surprise me. And surprise, you're going past 6 a.m. to like 8 a.m. Let's just keep you in this room, I guess. Whoop, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, you're over there? Okay, well... At least I have a visual. That's all I care about. That's all. Where'd you go? Oh no. Hi! Let's get you back to cam 15. How's that? Why are we skipping cams 1 through 10? There's not anything I'm missing. Is there? Is there like another panel that I can switch to? Is there like an upstairs or a basement? Maybe? I don't know. 
Where are you? Nope, you're not there. Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Okay. What happened to your eye? I'm assuming that this is a, uh, a sequel to the original Five Nights at Candy because, you know, she is missing an eye and part of her leg. But 6 a.m. on to night two. What is this? What is this? What is this? Minigame? Or something? Aha! Okay. I'm the monkey. I forget my name, actually. Is my name Chester? I think my name is Chester. Maybe. Well, let's do a little bit of exploration. Ooh, hello. What are these over here? Can I do anything with these? No? Just nothing to do with the pictures on the wall? What if I go uh, back into... Nope, nope, can't go there. Because that's where I'm supposed to be, right? As the monkey? That's where I run from? Or that's where I end up poking my head out? If I remember Five Nights at Candy's one correctly. I'm not really sure what I'm looking for. Ooh, hi, Blank. What's going on, buddy? Nothing doing? You don't want to get up for me? You dead? You still ugly? Yeah, I think you are, buddy. Oh, I can go down. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm just not sure where I'm supposed to go. Or I'm not sure where it wants me to go to make something happen. And I'm sure that this is going to give us a lot of backstory here. In some way, shape, or form. Eventually. Just now I'm just straight up lost. I have no idea where I'm going. I just haven't been in this area, so now I'm just going to just keep walking forward and hope something ends up happening. Or that I get... Ooh, a key! Oh, okay! Let's grab that. I see, this is the, uh, this is the office from the original Five Nights at Candies 1. And I know what this goes to. This goes... To that locked door that we saw... Up here? Basically where I started. Aha, there we go. Let's unlock this and see what happens. Nothing happens, it just shuts off? I think that's where the rat is supposed to live. Okay, continue on with the second night. Let's do this. Night two. Okay. One of the animatronics will attempt to climb into the ventilation systems to get you. Aw, oh, come on. If you hear noises coming from the vents, find the camera the animatronic is on, and then call the phone in the room to scare it away from the vent. I think I already hear it in the vent. Oh, hi! Okay, um... Okay. Oh, hey, buddy! Let's just go ahead and call that so you do not, uh, kill me, right? Correct? That was the monkey. So we gotta be really cautious of the monkey now. I guess every night it's just gonna be adding an animatronic. Nope. No monkey. God, he is fast. God, he, he has got some legs on him. Pretty good for an old animatronic. When did these animatronics learn how to climb into vents? I mean, these are some pretty advanced robots if you think about it. Any Five Nights at Freddy's game, the animatronics are super advanced. Whoop. Oh, you're there. Okay, get rid of you. Back to camera 12. Right? Go in there. Get in there, Cindy. Oh, you went to cam 11? Oh, no, where? Oh, there you are. There you are. Get out of the vent. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not ready. I'm really not ready at all to be jump scared. I'm not paired. Because uh, I know the jump scare is just going to be awful. Why are all of my phones disconnected? What is going on? What's going on? Why are all my phones useless? What happened? Oh, where, where are we going? Uh-oh, I can't click that one. I can't unclick it. Is that a glitch? Did I do something wrong? Oh, he's going to get into the vent and kill me. Oh, not unless Cindy gets me first. Okay, well, I am probably going to die either way. I can't do anything about it. I can't, I can't stop him. He's going to get into the vent and I'm going to die. 
I guess I'll just watch him climb into the vent and watch him kill me. So I can't do nothing. Why are all my phones disconnected? This is not good! No! I'm going to die! I'm going- Oh, hi! You've gotten closer. I'm gonna die. I, there's no way out of this. I'm go- Oh. No, just get it over with. Ah! Oh! I- I was confused! I thought you left! Ooh, 17 year old Marilyn Schmidt did not show up for school yesterday after she had allegedly been staying overnight with a friend in this week. Marilyn's friend later revealed that Marilyn was spending the night in an abandoned factory on St. Antonia's Road and that they had lied to Marilyn's parents. Marilyn had lost a bet with some of her classmates where she had then had to spend five nights in the factory. The search, a search party was assembled. They looked for something, something around the factory, but uh, for most of the tests or yesterday, she could not be found. Okay. Okay. What it seems that I need to do is that after I move Cindy into the room, I need to turn off the phone or else she will disable it permanently. I did not know that she would disable it permanently. Maybe I'm not... Reading. Close enough. Get out of there, monkey. Monkey see, monkey do. You in my room? Yes, you are. Let's get you back to Cam 11, because I like you in Cam 11 for some reason. I don't know why. That's kind of close to me. I should probably pick somewhere else, like Cam 15, which is a little further away from me. Or better yet, Cam 13, because that's as far away from me as possible. But if you want to chill in Cam 12, that's fine by me. Uh-oh. No, you good? Stop banging on my vents, Chester. You're gonna get some permanent damage. Hey, buddy. Let's move you to Cam 14. All right, I got the gist of it. I think I'm good. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Not about winning this night. I'm at 5 a.m. and we're going to beat night two. But I am just worried about later nights. I can just tell that this game is going to get considerably harder. We are only dealing with two animatronics, and there's so many animatronics that we have yet to meet. It's just gonna be great. Oh, there we go. 6 a.m. Hooray, night two complete. Now, do you have a minigame for me? Okay, Mr. Penguin. What do I have to do with you? Hello! What was that? And what is this on the ground? Oh, what did I pick up? What What is this on my head? Because it... Because it kind of looks like a penis. Like, let's be honest. I don't know what I just picked up. Okay, I guess one out of three. Let's find two more, right? Obviously. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oh, oh, am I piecing back Chester? That's his arm on my head. That's his arm, not 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 his not his wee wee. Oh, okay. I guess I don't pick up his head. Oh, I have to put it in the box before I can pick up more pieces. I understand. Okay, so now I should be able to pick up the head. Yep, there we go. Now we can put this one into the box. Into the box you go. Okay, only one more piece to find. Aha! There is the final piece in the security office. Okay, now into the box you go. And that's it! For the minigame, hooray! That was exhilarating. On to night three. Continue. Do I not get any hints? Is there going to be another animatronic? I can only assume that there's going to be another animatronic. There we go. So I have to deal with Candy. Now, Candy, do you work the same way as Cindy? I can only imagine so, right? Okay, so we got three animatronics to deal with. We got- Ah! Ah! What the hell? Sass.exe and error has occurred. Please restart the system. <gasps> oh, I understand. Okay, well, that was Balloon Boy. That wasn't fun. Oh, good lord. Okay. Okay, alright, so... Okay, it's throwing me two animatronics this night. One seems to be a hallucination of a penguin that does no longer exist. God, my English is great today. 
Oh no, Candy. Oh, Cindy's in my room. Get out of my room. Go to Cam 15. Turn off that phone. Hello? No. Okay, we are good, kind of. Okay. I understand what I have to do. I'm just freaking out because they're coming at me fast. You want to leave my room? Thank you. All right. Oh, he canceled it out. Oh, I was not fast enough to turn off. No, to turn off my camera. Not my camera, my phone. Okay, I need to take a breath. I'm freaking out a little bit. I should not be freaking out a little bit because I know what to do. I think the penguin just freaked me out. Monkey's in my vent. Monkey, monkey's in my vent. I'm gonna die to the monkey. Hi. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Just do it! Ha! Ah! <laughs> okay, who's gonna kill me? Monkey or Cindy? Or can Candy? Hi! Can I not use? I can't use the thing anymore. Hi! What's going on? Hi. I thought I was going to die to the monkey. Is that not going to be a thing? Do you like the pictures that I'm taking of you? At least the police will know what killed me. You. You did. They should disassemble you and why am I not dead yet? Is this keeping me alive somehow? Did I glitch the game? I definitely broke the game. This game just came out, and so of course, like any new game, uh, it's going to have a few kinks and a few bugs that the developer has to work out. But I don't want to rely on any cheap tricks to get through this game. I thought I heard the monkey. Get out of there, monkey. I don't want to rely on any cheap tricks to get through this game. And I don't want to have to wait for the developer to put out a non-buggy version, so I am going through Night 3 again to make sure that I do it correctly and not die to any kitty cats or monkeys and I've developed a strategy so all I have to do is keep flashing here till I see a little nice kitty cat then if I see a kitty cat bring him to one of the cameras if I hear the monkey like that scare him off back to doing this until I see a kitty cat back to camp 15 we're good Oh! Oh, hi! I'm alive! I, I apparently... I found another bug! I found another bug! I can't do anything! <laughs> oh, God. Hi, Chester! 5 a.m. One more hour to go. Hello, Cindy. I feel like these nights are really long. But then again, I say that about a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's copies. Whoop! Hello, monkey. Monkey see, monkey do. I'ma throw my poo at you, but not really, because that would just be disgusting. It'd mess up my chair, mess up my hand, get all my equipment nice and pooed up. I'm tired. That's why I'm talking about poo right now. <laughs> Oh, please get me to 6 a.m. so I don't have to talk about poo. Please. Like I was saying, I feel like these nights just are going on forever. But then again, it's probably just as long as any other Five Nights at Freddy's game that I've ever played. Hello, cat. Let's get you over to Camp 15. Come on, you gotta have that 6 a.m. close. Squeak, squeak. Come on. Come on, give me that 6 a.m. Give me that beautiful 6 a.m. sound! Yes! Victory. Now, do we have a minigame that we have to go through? Pretty sure we do. Yep, we do. Collect. Oh, are we playing as blank? Can I move? Can it? Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay. One out of four. New Candy and Cindy. Nope. How do I get out of this? Oh, space. Okay. So I guess this has turned into a Slenderman game and now we're just collecting notes. And were those chairs read before? Am I crazy? I swear those chairs were read before. Where is Chester? I don't know, but I think he was torn apart and he's in the back room. Okay, so that's two out of four. Let's see if we can find two more. 
wherever they might be. Oh, that's a dead end. Ah, here we go. For blank. Oh, how sweet of you. I'm a little worried because I know blank is going to appear in this game eventually. As an animatronic ready to rip me to shreds, but I'm just worried about how he's going to rip me to shreds or what I have to do to keep him from killing me. So, our band, that should be four out of four. Are we good? Okay, we are good. I thought I had to do something else. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. We will continue on in the future. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please like this video. It really helps me out. Also, be sure to leave comments in the comment section and subscribe to me so you can stay up to date with all the other videos that I'll be posting soon. Until the next video, I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Oh, 87. What? Oh, yeah. That wasn't even a jump scare. It scared the hell out of me. Hi. I wasn't ready for that. Okay. Ah!